The pressure on the mic! We're starting pro bracket, top 24, best of five throughout. We're here with Seb and we're blowing out. Oh, there we go. We're back in control. Yes. Let's look at our beautiful competitors. Here we got the nice 14 year old, 15 year old. I, can't, I always forget how old he is. Look, go facing off against Reese Betts. The pretty boy. Let's go. That's the five. We're losers round one. I'm expecting the blonde one to win. So, Pininja versus Mega Man. It's not a matchup but I get to watch off. Yeah, I don't think I've seen this one before. Who would you say is at a disadvantage on this one? I I don't know. This I just really have no clue about this MU. Um, I don't know what Greninja would be looking for, really. Greninja is very agile, though. Can be very fast around the stage. Glide around, float around, slide around. Yeah, he's gonna have speed over Mega Man for sure. But Greninja... <sighs> I think Mega Man will be looking for a lot of small damage with the projectiles. I wonder how effective Shadow Sneak is. Oh, wow. Literally, I just... <laughs> <laughs> is, that, well, is that answer your question? Well, that answers my question. I was literally just about to say, I wonder how effective Shadow Sneak is here. And then he literally just took the words right out of my mouth. All right, using the Leaf Shield to get that grab. Oh. That is a sad way to go. It's always a heartbreaker when you put so much percent on your opponent just to get down there like that. And then they start putting on extra damage which tilts you. And then when you finally do take that stock, you're already tilted. And you're like, you shouldn't even be in this position. And your mentality starts getting a bit whack. And you question your existence and, and yeah. And you know that your family don't love you. And, and you never really, uh, that girl never really liked you either. It's sad, it's sad. But he can recover and he's taking quite a bit of damage here. He should be looking to take that stock away. Yeah, Greninja needs to hit a heavy four there if he wants to take it. Or an up smash. That's the thing with Greninja, he's so agile but he doesn't have a lot of killing moves. Yeah. He's taking too much damage here. Very difficult looking for this stock. That okay, he's got yeah. the he's got yeah. the shuriken stuff. It's not bad, not bad. Respect sixty-seven percent, seventy percent up now. Goodness, he might be looking for up tilt soon. So what respect often does is use metal blade into up tilt. So we might see one of those come out, especially at a percent like like around about these kind of percent. Mega Man is playing with confidence. Which is why he keeps Z dropping the Metal Blade so that if he Z drops the Metal Blade on his opponent, they will plop, they will plop off the ground slightly so he can footstool them. And then he can lock with pellets. And then get the up tilt to end it. Sounds complicated but also sounds tried and tested. And obviously, if you're shielding the Metal Blade, he can just drop down and grab you. Yeah, yeah. It's the mix up. Oh, that down tilt could have, could have been really scary. Because as much as Mega Man has fought school stuff, so does Greninja. He has... Oh... oh that was unexpected. And he managed to do it. Jesus. Once again, sneak. Shadow Sneak. Goodness. I did not see that one coming at all. 30%. Oh my god. Can't believe that. By the way, do we do any sponsorship uh, videos? No? Sorry. So I did advertise Ting one time. Ting? <laughs> What's a, Ting? It's a cannon. It's a normal fizzy drink can. Interesting. Oh, I think I know the one. Actually, nah. It's taking a bit. <laughs> oh. Grand Finals has ended. Both doubles. But well, who cares about that, right? We're in losers round one, heading into game two. <laughs> Keeping the matchup the same one, Smashville. So, um. Mm. 
So like, yeah, game if game you, one. I, I don't know what to say about it. Like, if you learn anything from it, I think it's that mistakes can easily come for both of these characters, and you just need to be careful. You need to be on edge. I'm Maybe pretty sure. Don't play um, on the edge. Look out! Use Shadow Snakes to survive, not to really kill him. <laughs> it's really unfortunate. Something that only he knows. Best of threes, man. I mean, best of fives. Despite it, it, it seems as if it's only one more game, but it's just. It's long. It can be draining. Exhausting. So when you don't lose. When you don't win game one, you still have three games to climb. Do you know what I mean? It can be overwhelming sometimes. It does take its toll on you mentally. It's a lot of concentration. And not just for this one game, but remember, if you make it through. As you go further down the the actual bracket itself, it's going to get even more tiring. You've played so many matches. Towards the end, it just becomes a test of mental strength and stamina, really. Right now, these two are dead even. Like, cool. That was a well timed. That was a well timed air dodge. I, didn't I just. That to hit. Yeah, I didn't. I think um, Lugo did a low forward there and Reese backed off the ledge. Yeah. Saw it here. Oh dear. Oh dear. That is a high damage combo there. Full Greninja anyway. He is being careful, he's not just rushing in, he is taking his time before he throws out his option. He definitely doesn't want to take a lot of damage, but he's not really able to keep Greninja out. Nearly 80% now. Oh dear. Oh, again! Lugo, this time with a two-stop. I wonder if Lugo's getting a bit more of a handle, a more stro strong and firm grip on this MU. Right, game three, Town and City. So uh, Mega Man will probably be looking for up air stuff here. Up tilt earlier kills. Up smash earlier kills. Who would you kills. say the platform's favourite boss in this one? Definitely Mega Man. Yeah. If Mega Man, I, I was the victim of this. If Mega Man gets a landing up air on you on the platform, you're dead. Wow. You are dead. Doesn't matter what percent you're on. For the most part, you're, you're dead. I had a Mega Man. In, it was game five. It was an online tournament. Game five, grand finals. No, not game 5, game 4. And um, I was on the platform at 30, he was at 100 and something, and he just landed one up air into a second up air. And there was nothing that could be done. I died. Let's look at that. In that situation, I'm pretty sure Greninja would survive jumping out of the first one. Yeah. Barely, though. It's kind of risky though. 70 on town and city. I don't. I don't know. Like it's hard to know. You literally have something that has to be labbed out, man. I can't. I can't guess it. Ah uh, yes. If you don't get your your throw confirmed, you're getting backhead from Mega Man for sure. That would have killed. Oh. That backhead would have killed Lego if he had to go all the hits anyway. He's still trying, he's not giving up. He's, he's, he's definitely done well at taking less damage this round. But he's able to pile it on Ninja. He's staying away, definitely staying away, using his range to his advantage. Not really letting Greninja close him in. Okay. He is going full out with the projectiles this time around. Okay, okay. 
Oh my gosh, Luis is just walking away. Oh, okay. Oh, he's got a clash bomb. My gosh, shield, yeah. Uh, heavy four there coming out from the go. 130 on Luis. Uh, gotta be careful of this blade. TP's roll in. If he had rolled away, Luis would have killed him with an up smash for sure. For sure. I'm 100% sure of that. There's the back air he's looking for. Respect. Much better blade. 2 1. He's not gonna let himself come out of this tournament that easy. But can he pull off the reverse 3 0? Okay. Come back to this one. <laughs> so Smashville. Um. Oh, jeez. Uh, for Smashville, it's it's not a good start for Mega Man. For for Logo, it's gonna be quite good for him because you know forward airs at the sides and whatnot. But at the same time, back air for Mega Man at the sides and stuff. But I guess why I understand why Logo chose it, keeping the stage nice and short. Keeping himself next to Mega Man as much as possible. Yeah, don't give him a lot of space to run away into. Obviously, Mega Man's better when he's got distance. Oh, man, he's really trying to do Shadow Sneak finishes. He's got an extremely good lead right now. If he takes this stock, it'll be huge for him. Can he pull this off? Megaman's trying to keep his distance, but in this man, in this uh, stage, it's not easy. That's a critical cool forward there. Can look out now, still the stock. Oh gosh. Oh. Nah, it's too low, too low to take him all the way. I think, yeah, I couldn't have done anything about that one. Looking for his back airs, but look, Respect has brought it back to an, uh, a respectable percent, but that was a, that, that, if, if he can that didn't need to now, kill. Then bring it back to neutral, he still stands a chance. This is it, everything to play for here. Oh wow. Ooh, he locks him. Oh wow. Wow, that is a high damage, that is a lot of damage he's just done. That little move there oh. has just completely turned it around. He's gonna have to hold shield. Oh my god, you have to hold shield because you can't let Greninja hit you. Oh, he's got the metal blade click. Nope. The goat really wants to take this game. He doesn't want to go to a game five. Yep. Game fives are too scary. Down tilt. If you get down tilt by Greninja, it's shut. Like, he can kill you off an air dodge. And you know but what? It's all down to those five seconds where he just destroyed him. Did so much damage, brought up his percentage. And if he goes through, I think that's the moment he'll remember when he wakes up tomorrow. Well, Reese has done two games comeback. 
But can he do a third? Can he really do the reverse trio? They're heading into game five. I think this is I when the pressure's a, on. I think there's a level of psychology. I really think the, the stage the stage pick here is actually really important. Like, I, I It wasn't aimed properly. Your, your, watch your volume. Oh, yeah. Always pay attention. You need to be hitting the top. Cool. It's low. It's because you're talking low. You're talking like this. You're talking like this. I'm not going to start shouting. Man, look when I'm talking. It's up there, fam. <laughs> oh, shit. They started. <laughs> Where are they? Ah, they're in Smashville. Right. So, okay. I think... It's okay to come back here. To be honest, Lego got got un, an unfortunate spike done to him. He wasn't. It's not like he was doing like super bad in a neutral or anything. He was actually doing quite well. But oh dear, those up airs, they're doing uh, they're doing a ton of damage. That's not a good trade. Pellet versus forward air. I don't know. I think forward air wins in terms of damage output. <gasps> 102% but Greninja does struggle to kill unless he pulls him down into a down smash. That was good, that was a good tactic. Alright, he's gonna get his metal blade. What's next? Just dead dropping it? Alright. Okay. He's being careful about his landing. Oh, oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh. Gosh, they're both trying so hard. Oh so no, that, that was a, that up air didn't need to come out, and it's got him in a bad position. Oh my god, the water spurt! Jesus, the goat is not messing around right now. Ah, that roll, that roll back was a very painful. Until now, most of the projectiles have come from Mega Man. Just then, Greninja was really pushing. Laggy up B. <gasps> oh gosh. The, the goat needs to even this out right now. He needs <gasps> He got. Oh, he didn't get the lock because he's got too much rage, I think. Ah! If Beast had got that lock, he would have put on a shiza ton of damage. Like, it would have been mad. That's not going to kill Mega Man. Mega Man's a big boy. And there's the up air! 25%! That's, that's, that's nothing, that's, that's, that's like one neutral win. After five games, that's Reese that separates. Versus the GOAT. Final stock of game five. You go either way. Either way. Now they're both gonna try their hardest. They must be absolutely super nervous right now. Yeah. How much, they put, how much effort they put into getting to this point. And it okay. all comes down to this last stop. The thing is, because Mega Man's a projectile character, you have to maintain your cool. Oh my god, he needs to get away from the stack. Off stage. A back air will kill Greninja. So Greninja, Lego has to be super. Super careful of back at all times now. 61. Ah! Oh, oh, Jesus. Jesus! Oh my! Well, yes, your stage has to be careful not to get water spurted. Oh my God! Could Lego finish this? Not quite. It's too close. Oh, what's he done? This could be. Oh my God! The shadow sneak is not going to take it this time round. Oh, what's that? He's being so careful. He's not throwing out anything. Oh, is this it? Oh yeah, that is but the god doesn't throw anything out! Let's jump back here! Not gonna take it yet! 30% between them! No time for a try! Oh no! Up B going past the ledge. Respect. Barely, 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 barely takes it. 3 2 with a reverse 3 0 against Lego. Wow, he's gonna be very happy about that one. It was too close. It's definitely something to write home about. Definitely, yeah. Hopefully he can ride this momentum through into the next game. But first for you, it's always good to have very good feeling to have it. Oh jeez, that was that was intense, very intense. Twenty minutes set. Twenty minutes set. Wow. GG's to both players. Game fives are never easy.